Hey guys, what's going on? This is Paulie A. Fantone. I'm coming at you another video. <clears throat> Anyways, guys, as you can tell by my voice, I'm a little under the weather. I know I look like crap, and I sure as hell feel like crap. I just got to work uh, just a few minutes ago, and I figured I'd be damned if I didn't make this video. Anyways, guys, I know this is relatively old news, but uh, the other day I found out that, uh, unfortunately, um, <clears throat> I found out, unfortunately, that Actor Powers Booth sadly passed away of natural causes. You know, it kind of hit me like a ton of bricks because, like I said, he was one of my most favorite actors that I, I was able to ever, like, come across. I remember when the very first films I ever saw him in the year was 2000 and, uh, 2004. I saw his movie in HBO. It was called uh, Rapid Fire, starring the great, the late, great Bradley Lee. Obviously, he, he was a multi-talented person, but that's for another video. Powers Booth, <clears throat> in particular, I fell in love with his character, uh, Lieutenant Mace Ryan. I love how passionate Powers Booth was in this role and how like I said, he just he was just perfect. I feel that even though Power um, even though Rapid Fire was an amazing film, I don't think it would have been that good without Powers Booth in that role. And like I said, that's all it took. I mean I fell in love with him as an actor after that. I, I saw other films. Um, another movie uh, on top of my head, it was called Southern Comfort. It came out in uh came out in 1981. Co-starring Keith Carradine, and that was an awesome film. And that was like one of the very first roles I saw Keith Carradine in. I was I became a huge fan of him. I remember he was a part of movie um, Tombstone, even though he was the villain. It was still a great film. It was another villain. <clears throat> he was played another great villain in the movie um, Sudden Death, starring Jean Claude Van Damme. That was also in 1995. Wow, God, it just seems like yesterday. Uh, he was in the movie uh, Sim City. That was a great movie. He was in um, Fatality. Co-starring another late great talent in uh, Bill Paxton. We lost him a couple months ago. And Matthew McConaughey. That was a good movie, but I just did. I just, it just I like it, but I didn't like it at the same time because unfortunately Powers Booth was the bad guy and he had to meet his fate. And you know it is what it is. He was in the movie. Um, he was briefly in the movie The Avengers, and then he was in the uh, TV series. As I as I hear, I didn't actually watch the series. I just heard about it. But anyways, guys, I want to cut this video short a little bit because you know I, I'm not still feeling good. But Powers Booth, he was a really amazing actor. He was one of those actors that you just don't see, that does, that, you know, you just don't see that talent anymore. He was truly one in a million type of person. His legacy as an actor will never, will hopefully never be forgotten. And his, his work as an actor will never be duplicated. He was one of those actors who just, you know, he just made the pro, he just made the project better just by being a part of it. That's a skill that not too many people, especially today, can say. Anyways, guys. Paris Booth, wherever you are right now, I hope you're at peace. I hope you're happy. It's it's really unfortunate because I, you know it just dawned, it just dawned on me that uh, there's no, there's going to be no more projects, no more TV shows, or no more movies that are going to be a part of it, that he's going to be a part of because he's no longer on this earth. That's really unfortunate. Anyways, guys, um, Paris Booth, you, I will never forget about you. You're the, one of the most incredible actors I've ever ever been a part of shadow to the card has passed by <coughs> and i was never lucky enough to get your autograph but uh you're a hell of a person a hell of an actor anyways guys this is paulier fat tone and i'm out